Welcome to the next episode of the Explain Series with your host, Dr. Brett Palmer. And today we're going to be talking about pills, pessaries, and suppositories. And for those of you who know, well, uh, bully for you, but I get about around about two or three comments a week asking me to explain the difference. So I thought it would be quicker just to do a video on this. Uh, so what are pills? Well, pills, tablets, or capsules, uh, three different uh, things. Uh, but uh, you could argue that uh, pills and tablets are effectively the same thing and a capsule is a little bit different but that is where you get a, a powder in a um, uh, plastic coated uh, capsule. Capsules tend to float a bit uh, and so it's always better to put your head forward uh, when you've taken a sip of water and then swallow where pills are better to sling at the back of your throat and then take some water. Pills, capsules and tablets are generally slower acting uh, but uh, they tend to do the job and they're very very convenient. Uh, a pessary, on the other hand, uh, is something which is generally larger than uh, a pill or a tablet uh, and it is inserted into the vagina. Uh, that is usually inserted via an applicator. And pessaries are a great way of ensuring that the correct medication is only uh, placed where it needs to be and very localised in the upper vagina. And it's uh, great for treating uh, infections like um, thrush or BV uh, and also for uh, women who just need to have uh, uh, an applicator of other medicines. Uh, depending on what your gynaecologist uh, or sexual health doctor prescribes. In terms of suppositories, these are more uh, cylindrical uh, on domed uh, shaped um, uh, medicines and they are usually with a little bit of uh, lubrication uh, are placed uh, up the back side. Uh, now my thinking, why on earth would you put uh, a medicine up the back side? Well, it's actually a very good treatment pathway. It is quickly, very quickly absorbed uh, in the rectum and uh, in mainland Europe it used to be the most common way of giving medicines to children because children wouldn't spit it out, it would be absorbed quickly and you could uh, always ensure that the medicine is going to where it needs to go. Um, <clears throat> and that is effectively the difference between pills, pessaries and suppositories. Follow me in the next episode. Take care.